All right, thanks, Steve. Uh, the Newport News 911 Center dispatched a record number of calls in 2023. This comes amid a staffing shortage for dispatchers there and all across the country. 10 on your side, Amy Avery joins us now with the struggle to hire dispatchers mm -hmm. and the incentives the city is hoping will encourage people to answer the call. Amy? Well, Stephanie and Regina, the 911 Center in Newport News dispatched more than 340,000 calls for service last year. That's about 100,000 more than just two years ago in 2021. And the number of calls doesn't look to be slowing down anytime soon, so they're hoping more people will come answer the phone. I just love being able to assist people when they're having a hard time. Being a citizen of Newport News all my life is feels like my way of giving back to the community. Public Safety Supervisor Evan Augustus says he's answered some tough calls in his time here in the 911 Center. I'll say the first call I ever took, I had a suicidal person um, in his life on the phone, which was very hard, but you have to continue to keep going. And, you know, even when you're dealing with those critical calls, you still have to get ready for the next one. He's one of 42 staff members in Newport News answering 911 calls. Transfer, sir, go ahead. There are about a dozen short of being fully staffed. Newport News Police Chief Steve Drew says when tensions are high, they're the calm voice at the other end of the line. When you get some of those high priority calls, when those things, right, when, when tensions elevate by everything that they're dealing with, the stink. I, I just think they do amazing work. In total this year, Newport News answered 340,301 calls for service. This includes police, fire, and medical. Police made up the majority of those calls with just over 211,000. Their numbers are rivaling the city of Norfolk despite having about 150 fewer officers on staff. It's not like it is on TV, right? It's not I sit back and I'm in a nice room and, um, you know, things are slow and I pick up. I mean, things are moving. It, it's moving. Newport News is a, is a good sized city. Chief Drew says he knows it's a tough job to recruit for, so they've made some adjustments to shifts. Dispatchers in Newport News only work 10 hour shifts instead of 12 like neighboring cities, and their benefits kick in right when they start. Augustus says being a dispatcher is way more than just picking up the phone. You're giving that person a hand. You're giving them help. You're rendering aid. So even if it's even if you feel like you may not be, you are doing that. Newport News has a one day hiring event coming up on February 10th for police officers and dispatchers. Right now, there are about 40 officers short, but you can apply right now if you want to. We'll link how to do that inside this story on wavy.com. Amy Avery, 10 on your side.